这个我们显示呢，其实是覆盖的防护范围。哦。那我们现在这个天龙的系列呢，首先是一个区域的防空导弹系统。嗯。那么可以搭载不同口径、不同功能的弹药。嗯。包括像这个天龙一百、天龙的五零、三零、二零，那每一个数字代表是我们覆盖的防空范围。嗯、天龙一百呢，覆盖一百公里范围内置的这个防空的功能。嗯，五零就是五十公里的，一次向下排。So what we're seeing right now is the Sky Dragon surface-to-air missile is an air defense、uh, missile, and for the Sky Dragon 100, that 100 means 100 kilometers. That's the defense range of this. This rocket can reach. 在我们的最远端有一款这个天龙一百的发射车哦，这个能算是最大，算是最大的发射车吗？这个现在体积肯定在整场防空系统里面是最大的了。这款首先看这个长度啊，非常的长。那么这款产品呢，能够搭载四枚的天龙一百防空导弹。嗯。同时呢，三辆车可以同时工作。哦。一批能够拦截十二个同样的目标。So what we're seeing right here is the the missile system, the air defense missile system, the vehicle, the launcher for the Sky Dragon 100. It's a huge vehicle, and it's perhaps the largest here in the air defense uh, uh, unit that we're seeing right here during this、uh, in this hall. And Mr. Chen said, usually it's three vehicles to move in one、uh, group. So、that means it can、uh, offer a defense to like 12 different、uh, attacks. That's pretty cool. Wow. On December 24th last year, the Moroccan army made a special report on the country's 20th Air Defense Artillery Regiment in its official magazine, Royal Armed Forces. This unit is very special in that they are equipped with the Sky Dragon 50 medium-range air defense system imported from China. In the middle of this year, the first battery for the FD-2000B system was also received in the middle of this year, and was activated a few weeks ago in Morocco's first military base dedicated to long-range air defense. The FD-2000B system is an export version of the HQ-9B, which has a range of 250 kilometers. This report discloses the daily training and life of the troops, and at the same time fully demonstrates the training scenarios and unique system configuration characteristics of the Sky Dragon. 50 system. The Sky Dragon 50 air defense system is different from the Falcon 80 medium-range air defense system that is more familiar to the outside world. It is a surface-to-air defense missile system converted from an air-to-air -air missile. The development prototype of its intercept warhead was the DK-10A, which is usually exported along with Shaolong fighter jets. It is an active radar-guided medium-range missile. The DK-10A is based on the PL-12 air-to-air missile. After changing it for ground launch, the guidance method is still the inertial guidance for middle range, plus data link for fly correction, and the terminal stage is of active radar guidance. But the target tracking and middle correction are no longer controlled by the onboard fire control radar. Instead, they are controlled by the ground IBIS-150 radar through dedicated data link communication antenna. The launch method has also been changed to the ground inclined launch with a missile tube. Generally, after an air-to-air -air missile is modified and retrofit to a surface-to-air missile, due to the high resistance at low altitudes and the loss of the initial velocity given by the carrier aircraft, the range will be greatly reduced. The usual solution is to add a booster to the rear of the missile, but Sky Dragon 50 is not of such a design. Its solution is to directly replace the engine compartment with a stronger one. Therefore, the rear section of the missile is longer and thicker than that of the DK-10A. And the total length of the Sky Dragon 50 intercept warhead is 1.12 meters longer than that of the DK-10A. The engine compartment section is also 57 millimeters thicker. The middle wing is changed to a long wing that is more conducive to providing lift, and the shape of the tail correcting rudder wing has also been modified. After the modification, it is guaranteed that Sky Dragon 50 can intercept targets within 50 kilometers at an altitude range between 30 meters and 20,000 meters. This is much stronger than those directly adapted medium-range air-to-air missiles for ground-launch anti-aircraft systems. In terms of the configuration of the entire system, Sky Dragon 50 is also different from conventional air defense missile systems. It does not have a dedicated fire control radar, but an export version of S-band IBIS-153 coordinates target indication radar is responsible for both search and tracking. 
so the overall system is very simple. This radar is also used for the Falcon 80 medium-range air defense missile system. It is mainly responsible for long-distance and low-altitude search, and provides early target warning and guidance for the Falcon 80's fire control radar. The IBIS-150 radar is equipped with a lift rod, so it has a good tracking ability for ultra-low-altitude incoming targets, and it has a 150km early warning and detection ability for medium and high-altitude targets. In the Sky Dragon 50 system, the IBIS-150 radar is also responsible for the middle flying correction of the missile, but it does not directly communicate with the missile, but achieves the fly correction communication with the missile through the special data link communication antenna on the command vehicle. In addition, the Sky Dragon 50 also has a special feature that it is equipped with a dedicated VE-11A combat communication vehicle. From the antenna, it can be seen that the vehicle is equipped with short-wave communication equipment and troposcatter single communication equipment, with which is used for communication up to thousands of kilometers without satellite relay. The control vehicle also has a diffuse communication antenna, which can cooperate for communication and data exchange. This kind of scattering communication vehicle is responsible for communicating with higher-level early warning detection and command units such as long-range early warning radars and command posts thereby ensuring the coordinated action of the entire air defense network. On deployment, according to the resident photos of the 20th Air Defense Artillery Regiment, it can be confirmed that they are in Sui Si, which is located about 50 kilometers northeast of Rabat, the capital of Morocco. It can provide peripheral air defense cover for Rabat together with other positions. At the same time, this position itself also covers Kanitra, one of the three major cities in Morocco, 20 kilometers away. In recent years, due to the continuous strengthening of Algeria's airstrike force, the pressure on Morocco has been increasing day by day. The two countries have been hostile for many years because of the Western Sahara issue. The Moroccan Air Defense Force also imported Chinese FD-2000B long-range air defense systems. The first battery for the FD-2000B system was received in the middle of this year, and was activated in Morocco's first military base dedicated to long-range air defense. The battery of the FD-2000B long-range air defense system received is one of four batteries that Morocco ordered in 2017, which has a range of 250 kilometers. The military base, inaugurated recently, is located about 50 kilometers north of Rabat. The base, extending over an area of 42,000 square meters, has a fixed circular starting point with a diameter of 170 square meters, equipment repair hangars, administrative headquarters, and barracks.